Hey, good morning, guys. Your girl story time with Miss Ty on deck. How y'all doing? Yep, so I am actually on my way to work. You guys see the BART behind me, so you should already know what I'm doing if you've been following my um some of my earlier vlogs. I am actually, yeah, on my way to work. Happy Tuesday. I don't know when you guys are going to see this, but today is actually Tuesday for me. <clears throat> Excuse me, and I thought I'd jump on just to tell you guys good morning and ask you guys a quick question. Have you guys ever ate free lunch? Yes, free lunch. Have you ate it? Okay, well, of course I have. <laughs> you know, most people in my generation before and a lot of people now, quiet as kept, is eating free lunch. But good, because you should be having it because um, our tax dollars pay for it. But anyways, I have a funny story to tell you guys later on in the day about free lunch. Stay tuned, you don't want to miss it. Did you hear what I said? Stay tuned, you don't want to miss it. I have a funny story to tell you guys um, that I can recall from a childhood memory about free lunch. All right, guys, I'll check in with you later. Bye. Almost there, y'all. I'm at the bar station now, and it is almost my turn to get on so I can reach my destination. I have a morning meeting to start off my day. Hopefully, it is short and sweet. And the weather out here is really, um, it's cloudy. It's, um, yeah, cloudy, whatever else. It's really cloudy, but just, whatever. But I hope it stays that way because I really don't like a lot of hot weather. So I will Six check back in you guys. Train, now approaching platform two. So. Your girl has arrived. Oops. Your girl has arrived in the building. Time for me to go make magic for a while. And when I come back out and take my break, I should be able to finish my story for you guys. Just wanted you guys to take that little uh, last couple minutes of the elevator ride with me. You know, so I'm not riding alone because y'all know the crazy stuff people do in elevators, right? All right. guys I'm out here on a break question what do you guys know about office politics so if all the people who work in an office or office setting what y'all know about office politics right they vary in some degrees one of the things about office politics that can be really uh, difficult to deal with or, or just whatever to deal with is when you clearly know that someone has did or said something that would be unbesuiting of you or to you or to your character or something else like that um, and then they but they they will smile or try to you know or try to act friendly towards you when you know that it's basically the same thing as you know um not really well kind of kind of like frenemies <laughs> just meaning in the aspect of you know uh you you're not really friends but in a professional setting everybody's happy and diplomatic and this and that which is real cool beans ultimately until you see the people you know you see how how people set things up and play and make it seem as if you know there's something you have this great relationship but the whole time they're doing the two-faced commercial thing. Anyways, okay, so now that I said that part, <laughs> you guys can live a longer life now that you knew that, right? Okay, guys. So remember I told you guys I was going to come back and tell you guys a story about free lunch. Okay, well, I'm going to go to an area you guys know so y'all can get comfortable with this story. <laughs> um, anyways, so obviously many 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 moons ago when I was a kid there was this um oh did I show you guys my outfit today in case I didn't I just got on this regular polka dot skirt with this little gray scarf and a black blazer and black heels that part well anyways so um I was told to go to we wish to go to this little recreation center right and school was out it was actually summertime and so anyways, you know how I used to get you guys those little free lunch things to go, those little containers? Um, you know the little four, I'm a, if I can find a picture of it, I'm going to insert a picture about... Now, okay, but anyways, those little containers, right? So you, the thing about it is when it was summertime, when it was summertime, they would feed the kids. They would feed the kids, but that kids had to eat on site was the rule. 
so anyways <laughs> um what happened so we went to go get some me and a friend of mine because her mother told her to go down there too and go get some free lunch we went to go get the free lunch and we was told we had to bring it back we could we can go get the free lunch but we couldn't stay there and eat it so um <laughs> so we went to go get it and we was trying to take it and i was like no you can't leave with it right so for whatever reason we waited till they turned their heads and we was running off the campus with it why in the world there is always a flow joke amongst us can you, can you guys tap into that energy there is always a flow joke amongst us because there was this um i think at the time i was like you know probably eight or nine so the, it was probably somebody who's like 17 to 20 or something else like that a dude and they was like hey you can't take it off the campus why did he start running like flow Joe, like he was top flight security himself and chased us down. I mean, we had to run so hard, you know, we kind of probably burned some of the soul off the back of our shoes trying to get away from him. And this was all for a free lunch, you guys. So just to let you guys know, stuff be real, <laughs> you know. So, but um, I do think that it is good to offer free lunch. Um, I think it's even better to offer free lunch that is desirable to eat because after all, Again, our taxpayer dollars are paying for it. Anyways, now that I know you guys can have a better day, that you heard that story. Cool beans. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just living my greatest life today, guys. Just like every day. What are you guys doing today? I hope you're living your greatest life too. Hold on, let me show you guys um, where I was last time. Yeah, guys, I'm back over here in this area trying to get me a little... Um, I don't know, just taking a quick break away from it all before I go back in and do the last things that I need to kind of occupy for my day. And I'm going to go ahead and um, take a lunch break and then give, you know, you know how people do. Hey, how do you guys spend your day? How do you guys break your day up? You know what I mean? What takes your mind off the work at hand? And again, are you guys doing the type of work that you love doing? If you are, that is cool beans. What type of work is it? Some of you guys, actually, like a couple of you guys commented um, on my last vlog and actually said, but it was like only a couple of you. That looks nice, huh? If I, Let me see. I'm going to try to get close enough so you guys can see the fish in there. Oh, I can't. It won't let me get any closer for you guys, but there's actually fish in that water. And those fish are kind of big. That part. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that view. So you know what I realized about myself? I realized that what I need is a camera. Your girl need a camera because when I be doing my vlogs and walking you guys around with me and all that other stuff, I'm on my phone, um, which is cool beans, but it be doing a whole thing about storage and all of that. So I, I realized what I need is a camera. So what I'm going to do um, in my about me or my bio, whatever it is, is I'm probably gonna include my um, PayPal link. So if there's anybody out there who wants to support, um, and help my channel grow. I really appreciate it. That's always cool beans. Um, and if you if you don't and you can't, that's okay too. Please, you're supporting by coming up. I mean, by watching me on my daily journeys anyway. I appreciate that love too. Trust me, I do from the bottom of this thing. My heart, you know, all that good stuff. Um, but if anybody do want to support and you know, um, you got your little old $5 and you want to, you know, kind of put that towards something. Hey, now you know I love you for that. <laughs> you know that'd be like super cool beans. Um, <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'm going to go ahead and walk on up out of this area now because I think it's time I get on up out of here. Right? What's your favorite thing to do on the weekends? I love to know that. What's your favorite? Oh, you guys see me on escalators a lot today, huh? I was living that escalator life. <laughs> but actually, that's when I was just going going to work, going up the escalator, and then, yeah, going, yeah, something like that. But um, anyways, what's your favorite thing to do on the weekends besides R&R? &R? Some people's favorite thing to do is R&R. &R. That's the best thing on the menu. Anyways, guys, my day is going um, okay so far. I think I will check back in to blow you guys kisses and give you guys a a wrap up of the day when it is over so please make sure to stay tuned and join your girl 
I do not know what I'm having for lunch, although it is about lunchtime for me. It's almost like about right now, maybe like 11.45 a.m. my time, something like that. So you guys, chime in. Let me know. All right, I'll check back in with you later. Yep. So, hey guys, I am back. It is the end of my day, and I'm actually downstairs at BART. I've left my office, and I'm at the BART station, if you can see around me, waiting on my train to take me back to my car and go home. Um, so, a wrap-up for today. Today's wrap-up is, um, this is one of those days that you get out of bed, you got the best of intentions of being successful and complete a whole bunch of stuff and then you get in there you do what you can and you run into the some bumps and hiccups and you're like okay i'm just gonna finish this day off and um hope tomorrow's better yeah but um you know that's all a part of it because that happens as well i just thought i'd take you guys with me oh i, I said i was gonna do a wrap-up anyway and come back to you guys and say bye bye so um thank you guys so much for joining me i don't know if i'm gonna get back come back to you guys after I get off at my stop but like I always say please make sure to like comment share and subscribe I hope you guys can hear me tell anyone and everyone that your girls out here doing vlogs work vlogs that's what it look like where I'm at um, make sure to get this video a big thumbs up like I always say there's always another story to be told thank you for joining me but for now bye